Hello and welcome back to my channel, Craft Time by Casey. I am Casey and today I am so excited. I got my Sam's bead box in the mail for the month of September 2022. And as you can see, the theme for this month is Forest Walk. Forest Walk. If you would like to see what came in the box for this month, then stay tuned. All right, so let's see what we have. All right, we have the packing list. As always, it comes with a brief story of what the inspiration for the box is. One thing that stands out to me in this story, it talks about the redwood forests of Northern California. Um, I am very excited to see if these type of things in the Henry uh, Cowell State Park, if these are the inspirational things for this bead box, then I am very excited to see what we have in store for us. On the back, it has a detailed list of what came of what comes in the box. And then of course you see some really good information there at the top about their live sales and their website. So let's get a sneak peek. All right, so we I see a lot of greens and browns in there, so I'm going to set these aside and we'll go through them. Check glass teardrop striped Amber mix, six by nine and a half millimeters, approximately 20 pieces. All right, the hole for these goes straight through the top to the bottom. We see there. I like that amber color. Of course, it has that stripe at the, well, some of them have two stripes and it looks like some of them just have the one stripe. Interesting, very cool. Tiger eye faceted rondelle four by six millimeter, seven and a half inch strand. Now, I love the coloration of these. It almost has a gemstone look about them. As you can see, none of them are the same, but these are quite beautiful. Check glass, flat pear brio woodlands mix 12 by 18 10 piece set now these almost have a caramel look to them okay and it looks like they're pretty similar on each side not the exact same on each side but fairly similar that one's got a kind of a white stripe on the back of that one and the hole is at top across the top like that very nice check glass cowgirl flower crystal latte silk mix in uh, copper 11 millimeter 10 piece set these are so pretty i love that almost gold wash and of course they called it a copper wash so those are really really pretty and the hole goes through the side of the flower just like that Check glass elephant copper wash leather brown um, and then 11 by 15 millimeters six piece set you can see right there it's got that same copper wash that the last one did same on both sides and the hole goes through like that nice Check glass bicone smoky topaz eight millimeter about 30 pieces these are very cool of course you can see the hole right there very nice we definitely have a color theme going so far with our different shades of of brown and amber check glass dragonfly red silk picasso copper 15 millimeter four piece set this almost has a Native American carving kind of feel to it with, with regards to the dragonfly. Very nice. I like that weathered look. You can see across the band of it, it definitely looks, carries over that weathered look. Check glass rice bead bronze luster, three by six millimeter, approximately 65 pieces. Of course, you can see that luster finish, that shine on it. Very nice. Hole goes straight through. 
check glass bifocal in garnet copper 17 by 21 millimeters and then we have check glass pine cone smoky topaz copper 12 by 24 and a half millimeter now i don't see a pine cone in this <laughs> um i think it looks cool I i'm definitely digging it um i'm just i look at it and i see fire like it looks like fire to me let me know in the comments down below am i crazy i mean it looks cool i just don't see a pine cone of course you can see the hole straight through and then of course the b focal same on both sides hole right there red jasper donut 30 millimeters seven millimeter hole one piece and it has almost that that natural stone element to it and you can see the other side i can see where the the lines and colorations and stripes on these might be diff are probably going to be different on each one so here is what mine looks like and it's decently thick check glass spacer truck amber topaz four millimeters approximately 200 pieces i love small colorful beads that can be used as spacer beads these are beautiful and we see still everything we have so far is in the different shades of kind of brown and amber so it's very very pretty very neutral all right so here is our first turn into green so we have check glass leaf jungle glow mix 13 by 17 and a half millimeter 12 piece set so these leaves look like they're the same, just in different colors. And of course you see the hole at the top of each one. And it looks like it has the lines, the striations on one side and on the other side, it is smooth. And it's the same in both colors. Check glass, table cut oval, green meadows mix, 13 by 19 millimeter, one piece. Now, normally when I see mix, I think there's a mixture of beads, um, kind of like this down here that we had, but I'm guessing in this one, it means a mixture of color. And you can see that almost like drip of color that it has uh, with that green and yellow. And then of course it has almost a brown look on the outside and then the hole goes straight through. It is very pretty though. Check glass saucer in olive, two by five millimeters, about 75 pieces. And these are super pretty. I love, like I said before, I love the small beads that can be used almost as spacers. And you could see this one is pretty flat, very pretty. Check glass table cut oval green silk Picasso, seven by 17 and a half millimeters, six piece set. That's a really pretty shade of green. It's the same on both sides and then the outside is that kind of weathered brown and different shades of green look on it of course the hole straight through long ways check glass melon barrel and olive bronze eight by 14 millimeter eight piece set you see that bronze wash through the lines of these melon beads. I like that almost dark shade of green. Check glass faceted rondel rainforest mix, six by eight millimeters, 20 piece strand. So this color variation is very, very pretty. And it, you can see where the hole goes straight through. These are beautiful. Fancy Jasper Smooth Round 8 millimeter 7 inch strand. I like that there's a couple like tan or completely different shades. Very nice. Ooh, that one's pretty right there. They feel very, very smooth. I like the gemstone. Check Glass Faceted Bicone Green Luster 8 millimeter, approximately 20 pieces. So you can see the finish on that where the whole thing is very rustic, very weathered. Check glass leaf copper wash forest fern mix. Nine by 14 millimeter, 25 piece strand. 
So you can see that copper wash in the leaves. Very pretty. And then of course that holes across the top. There you go. Very nice. Check glass table cut oval jungle mix. Nine by 11 and a half millimeter, 10 piece set. So these look like they are, I was gonna say tricolor, but almost four colors with the dark on the end and the brown and the white and then the shade there, the green, I guess, at the end. So flipping them from one side to the other, they are not the same on both sides. Very much a jungle mix, a, a variation of color. And of course you have the hole that goes straight through. House made check glass bead mix, lush jungle. And it says it's um, 1.65 ounce bag. And then it tells you at the bottom the different types of beads that are in there. The bellflower, teardrop brio, druk round, tumbled stone in olive and smoky topaz. So the, these are the odd shaped ones. It has a hole straight through. And then of course, same bead in green. And then the one I said the, got the drops and the round beads. Those look like they're about eight millimeters. And then the, this is the bell one. Got the little cup on the end. This is a very interesting mix. When I saw the bag, for some reason in my head, I was almost thinking like rock chip, and this is definitely not that. So very nice. Non-design tree of life pendant, antique copper plate, 19 and a half by 23 millimeter, and a Tierra cast oak leaf charm, antique copper plate, six by 10 and a half millimeter. And it says it's lead free made in the US. That's really, really pretty. I like that kind of dark, deep engraving. If you look at the side, it's a lot, quite a bit thicker on the side. And then of course it's smooth on the back. And then of course we have the little charm and that is definitely little <laughs> for the charm, a little bitty leaf charm. It's very cute. I can see that hanging off of a bracelet. And in the themes of this um, box with the, you know, greens and browns and trees and jungle, um, that would go fit in quite nicely. Here is everything that came in Sam's bead box for the month of September 2022. And I... I'm really enjoying this color palette. The, the neutrals, the kind of, the nature-driven colors. It really hits that theme of the forest walk with the different shades of, you know, the browns, tans, ambers, and of course the variation of greens um, between the, you know, brighter greens like over here and then the hunter greens. Um, I mean, it just really, really nailed that uh, the theme for this month. Some standouts for me, I really love this strand of rondelles, that almost gen that gemstone look and the color variation of these rondelles is just so beautiful. Absolutely love this strand right here. I also love these small colorful beads that can be used as spacers. I really think that is pretty creative. I really like that. So if you like this video and you want to see other videos like this, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below and give me a like, leave a comment. I absolutely love reading my comments. You guys are so, so kind. And I would really love to hear your thoughts on this bead box. Let me know what you think about this month. I want you to know that I absolutely appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. And I definitely look forward to seeing you in the next one. Bye.